Hi, I'm Dr. Cheryl Olson. Recently we had the opportunity to videotape a single incision robotic cholecystectomy, which is removal of a gallbladder through one incision at the umbilicus. I just wanted to share that with you, explain a few things about the procedure, and then uh, invite you to call us if you have questions about this procedure or if you're having any symptoms that you think might be caused by gallstones. This is the Da Vinci SI system used for the single incision procedures. We're doing a cholecystectomy today. This is the view that the surgeon has. Uh, this is making the incision at the umbilicus. We have to elevate the umbilical stalk to make room for the silastic uh, gel port here. This is inserted into the abdomen. It keeps the air in place then allows us to put multiple instruments through this one uh, entry site. This is the CO2 gas going in and the laparoscopic port that goes through that silicone gel port. We inspect the abdomen uh, with the camera free just to make sure we're in good position. We have to adjust the table before bringing the robot in. There's Jimmy driving the SI system in for docking. We dock the camera port first, uh, connecting it to the arm so that the robot senses that it's connected, getting that in place. Then under direct vision, we insert the curved cannulae. So we're positioning the camera here so that I can see as I insert that curved cannula always where it is. The assistant port is inserted here. This is the only free port uh, where the assistant does control the gallbladder and the level of traction on the gallbladder. Once we put the camera back in then, we look directly at each cannula and insert instruments only under direct vision, advancing them very carefully so that nothing is inadvertently damaged. Once the instruments are in, I go to the console where I control the instruments that have been inserted. And the critical thing here is that my right hand is being controlled by my right hand, but the instrument actually originates from the left. So the robot crosses my hands. Once we have the uh, cystic duct and the cystic artery dissected free of each other and clearly visualized, then we'll clip each uh, structure such that we can divide them and have no bleeding and no spillage of bile. Sometimes we do what's called a cholangiogram where we stick a catheter in there and take an x-ray, but in this case we've simply isolated each structure, clipped them, and uh, divide with scissors and then begin the dissection onto the liver bed. The dissection is progressing. We've identified the cystic duct which leads from the gallbladder. There I've placed clips and uh, we've transected the duct and the artery and now we're separating the gallbladder from the liver and just uh, taking down these pretty much avascular attachments but sometimes they do bleed. Uh, the da Vinci system allows uh, for very very minimal blood loss um, typically and uh, again we just progress along. We do have a little smoke evacuator that uh, sucks out the smoke to keep the vision as clear as possible. Again, everything is done under direct vision. Uh, we never move instruments around uh, too much without being able to visualize them clearly. The gallbladder is going to separate here just in a moment and then we'll take a look back behind. My assistant pulls the gallbladder over the liver we look for a nice ultra dry liver bed there and then uh, remove our instruments and then start undocking the robot first by removing the instruments and then that curved cannulae that allows me to switch my hands and really allows for the procedure to be done through such a small incision. Once we have the robot completely disassembled we separate the camera which gets sterilized and then the plastic cover keeps the rest of the camera head sterile and uh, again they'll back up the robot now that we've undocked. It's important to know that we can't ever move the patient while the robot is docked. There's a new table coming out that will allow us to do that but with this set we cannot. This is removing the gallbladder uh, intact through that one incision at the uh, umbilicus 
and then we simply close up the fascia. So this is a two-layered closure. Uh, I believe here we're probably on the skin there, We're returning that to its normal beautiful state. This again is our da Vinci, and you can see with the arms there, the little connections there that actually turn uh, circular motions to then cause the cables to move, which allows the instrument to move. It's all computer-generated motion. And thank you for watching our single incision robotic cholecystectomy today. Uh, here at uh, Surgical Associates of La Jolla, Scripps Memorial Hospital. Please feel free to give us a call if you're suffering from gallbladder disease. Thank you.